what is up you guys it's sandra welcome back to the channel welcome back to the sandra said what today i'm back with a quick video this is a follow-up video as i promised on the ssw merch wig deep wave 30 inch wig as you can see i have the wig on this is a glueless wig and i told you guys i was going to bleach the cap the knot and i was also going to show you guys how i do you know the more defined curls so i did do go ahead and bleach the knots currently i don't have any product on the wig and this is how it looks um after that um what i did was i just went ahead and added a few products and i'm going to show you when i wash the hair uh, I do have a video for a shorter wig, a water wave wig. Um, it's called a glueless, uh, what is it? Um, a realistic review, glueless wig review. If you want to see how I bleach the knots, it's really two products. It's not a big deal. So as you guys know, if you've been following me for a while, I do use Mane and Tail shampoo and conditioner on my natural hair. And I used it to wash the wig. What I did was I washed it with shampoo after I bleached the knots and then I went ahead with the conditioner and I actually damped with the hair still wet. I added the conditioner to it and I didn't rinse the conditioner out. What I'm doing is I actually leave the conditioner in the hair as a leave-in conditioner. I read that you can do it on the box so that's what I'm doing. So for the wig all I you needed some water some mousse and some people do use some oil but i'm not using it because the hair as you can see is very shiny because i of the leave-in conditioner so i just went ahead and sprayed the hair and by section it's really not complicated you guys and by section i just go ahead and i take a little bit of mousse and then i go thoroughly through the hair from roots to ends and I make sure I get the ends really good because sometimes we just bypass them and we don't do anything to it. So that's pretty much it for the hair. And also, as you can see, I do have the hair as a side part. I typically like a metal part, but if you want, you can actually just move the hair to the side and it's literally a side part. So this is the mousse again. Just gonna repeat the same thing to the other side as you can see i don't remember if i have a cap on or not you don't really need a cap for this hair and um just throw it on and go of course you can do baby hairs if you want um you can um melt it if you want you can do a lot of different things with it but this the purpose of this video is that it's supposed to be a throw on and go glueless wig so you're not putting products in your hair or if you're in a hurry or if you don't feel like bothering doing anything else so this is what the hair looks like the curls are super defined some people do like that wet you know water wet look and this is if you want to also one thing i forgot was to go in and spray it with some um sheen you know oil sheen and that's going to make it the hair even shinier i'm going to do that off camera um yeah just go ahead and spray it with a little bit of sh um oil sheen and bada bang bada boom it's not complicated again you guys i appreciate you guys for watching i have been posting a lot of videos i have been posting a lot of hauls but it's not just hauls i will be also posting you know my normal content but um it's just I'm trying to get content to you guys and sometimes it's hard for me to find the time to sit and do research on a topic and I do have a million topics in my head I'm going crazy and I need to put them in video just so that I actively take the conversations out of my head and put them on film and we can have it together I know some some people be tripping so y'all be tripping y'all be trying to drag me okay um, but <laughs> you know with all of that i just i need to remove everything from my head because my head is going to explode like social media is driving me nuts and all the crazy things i see and you know different opinions that i have on a lot of projects on a lot of things but anyway you guys so here is the wig again i have um done um moved it to the middle it's a middle part i was actually filming that night i actually batch create content so i do have a lot of content on my instagram um i do have did film this makeup look which i'm going to post on instagram i don't know if i'm gonna post it here i might just post it here um and then you know show you guys how i um 
I forgot what is this look even for yeah yeah I'm posting um fashion content oh yeah what I was gonna say is that I do have um you I don't know if you guys saw my forever 21 haul where I have the golden skirt that everybody seems to love um so with that skirt i did film a fashion look which i'm going to post to my instagram if you want to see any of my fashion looks go to my instagram and on my tiktok also sandra said what so i did film a look with the skirt is gorgeous i absolutely love the skirt love the look but um i'm thinking about maybe posting it on here i'm not sure it would be like another five six minute video because those looks they take a lot of time to prepare for but and you know sometimes i get like 30 minutes of content and i can only post like 30 seconds or 15 seconds on instagram but if you want to see that look go to my instagram and i will be posting on here again i thank you so much for watching see you next time Bye bye